Okay, hello dear friends. Good, uh, good evening. Such a beautiful, beautiful evening. So today we will use this uh, uh, tea mug. There is a drainer inside, but this one today we want to make some tea. Oh, sorry. Today we want to make the tea that is. Uh, that is a flower tea, and uh, so there is. Um, it's. Uh, I want the tea to be free flow. Let's take a look at this tea, and this tea is called Dongfang Mei Ren. Dongfang Mei Ren. So I think I have boiled the water. How is this tea made? It's made of green tea or white tea, and this particular one is made of uh, green tea. And long, slender, like a finger long, oh, my fingernail is not so long, long, slender tea, and uh, combine them together at the bottom. And inside, put a flower in. And because the inside is more, so when it wraps up, it's like this. And when it is totally uh, still a little bit wet, they form it. I do not with a hand or with some tools, maybe a piece of plastic to, to cover it and then use hand uh, a little bit like sushi to wrap it and let it dry. So when you put in hot water, these little uh, tea sprouts will start to open up. But here there is a, a tie there. It's uh, already tied a knot, so it will not fall apart everywhere. It forms a very beautiful, beautiful uh, shape. So this is a flower from my backyard. I was in my room and my husband came with this. Oh, I think this is so thoughtful. He was taking care of the backyard. And this flower, I love it very much. It is in my backyard. I can still see it, but uh, it's, uh, it's behind the bush, kind of. So usually we do not see it that much often. So I open up my teacup and put it in. Now I will drip in some hot water. Are we ready? I go get hot water. You can see it now. Okay, sorry. <laughs> mm. My husband is making carnitas. Okay, so this water has been boiled and uh, cooled down for a couple of minutes. So it's not extremely hot. 
Now let's take a look at it. Because it's not extremely hot, so may so it may take some time to open it up. And make sure when you make green tea, do not make it extremely hot. And uh, from my experience is that when the tea is too hot, the flavor is just uh, not so good. It becomes suddenly becomes very bitter. Oh, it's starting to open up. So when the water gets in, uh, the tea leaves start to soak up the water. It becomes uh, uh, heavier. Okay. Now I raise it down. Let me take a look. Lower it. So the background I was, uh, the computer screen, I was putting uh, uh, a music video with, uh, with natural, I think it's, a, it's kind of a, an aerial scene, aerial view. Maybe drawn footage of some extraordinary, beautiful places. Okay, I now I will <coughs> not make too much effort to talk. I find sometimes I make too much effort to talk. And my voice, the vibration is not that good. My voice vibration is not very good when I pay too much effort. So just uh, um, not really whisper, but uh, talking with uh, an effortless voice. As long as uh, I am close enough to the camera, it will be good. Oh, wow, I forgot to see the flower. I was looking at uh, the sea. Now we raise it a little bit. So this tea is called Dongfang Mei Ren. I will um, smell it a little bit. And um, there are a couple of uh, uh, tea leaves coming up. Do not worry about it. It's uh, a lot of work to... Oh, there, there are some other flower bud coming up. It is just imagine you tie all these teas and flowers all together. It's a lot of work. This is such a beautiful landscape, flower landscape. And here we have a chrysanthemum flower. And on the bottom, I think it's, it's like... Uh, it's like a flower with a dish, the yellow, <coughs> yellower color, a little bit more yellowish color is the other one. Now I will taste it a little bit. Now we take a look. Mm, it smells good. Actually, it does not smell 
too much. There is no smell of um, of jasmine. This is not jasmine tea, and uh, those flowers does not smell. They are not supposed to contribute much into into the tea flavorings, and uh, sometimes you hear people say. Uh, the flower is cooling down, or the flower is uh, energetic. It's actually mostly, as you can see, this is uh, uh, the beautification of tea. So the main purpose is beauty, is good looking, and uh, any of its a medicinal effect or calming effect or cooling effect is uh, is secondary. It's mostly because it's beautiful. When we can enjoy something not only delicious, but also so breathtakingly beautiful, it is very, 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 very beautiful, right? Let me taste it a little. It's still quite hot, and uh, it's uh, it tastes green tea and uh, very light. And I think another benefit of making it so beautiful, so that you do not uh, mess around with it, right? So sometimes. People drink tea, we drink tea, we put milk, we put sugar, we put honey, we put these things. And that's not good. Tea should be enjoyed pure by itself. So it's already so pretty. You do not want to want to damage its beauty, right? Okay. Oh, my computer is a little bit noisy. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Okay. Let me try. I will close up some programs. There are some, must be a couple of uh, programs taking too much energy of my pewter. Oh, now it's better. I can feel it. Now I want to make it totally, completely better. Now we are. Okay, now it's good. It's so beautiful. Okay. So, it's a uh, a beautiful Saturday evening. Enjoy your time. And this afternoon, I listened to some productivity uh, class, and um, and uh, as I was walking or driving, those wonderful classes, and. Uh, it's very stressful. It's very stressful. So when you have a, a good weekend, enjoy it and um, do something unproductive and uh, give yourself a break. I think uh, have a, a cup of tea or just... Uh, just not doing anything is very productive for me, is very uh, healing for me, is very uh, self-nourishing. 
and uh, do not be too stressed out and uh, uh, there are too many people, too many high achievers out there in this world making these wonderful uh, intimidating videos so we <laughs> we just need to to calm down and be comfortable with uh, whatever life we are living in we have uh, a Saturday evening where we can enjoy the evening, have a cup of tea. Nothing can compare with it. We are so rich. And this is uh, some of uh, the richness that, uh, that other people cannot uh, majority of people cannot cannot uh, cannot imagine or understand if you are watching this video you have the time to waste some of your time to spend some of your time you are incredibly rich you can sit down and treat yourself. You are incredible, incredibly rich. People who make millions of dollars cannot, cannot even imagine our richness. That's why they work. That's why they do things. Anyway. This sounds a little bit too demotivational, right? Shall I call a, call it a cup of uh, demotivational tea? Might be a good idea. Why not? Mm -hmm. Anyway, oh, tea is good. Oh, oh, wow, this is so good. There is a little bit of sweetness comes out. <gasps> Absolutely beautiful, beautiful. It's so good. Oh, my. Oh, wow. Uh, the key to enjoy this is to make a big mug. This size is good and fill in water later on so that uh, so that uh, there is uh, some water in some uh, becomes stronger the tea becomes stronger and then you have new water in and blend it in and that is good and uh, otherwise it may become too strong enjoy it this is so beautiful. I love you. I really do. Do, 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 do. Do you like this kind of video? Maybe I should uh, make a, a podcast. Podcast in the sense of podcast, but maybe YouTube or something. I have not yet thought about it, but I, I did think about it okay let me share some of my thoughts and uh, because I do a lot of uh, uh, listening while I was walking and uh, sometimes I was thinking when I walk I do not see the screen and uh, it's a it could be a very very good time to learn something new for example learning a language I am uh, making my new class of Chinese language through storytelling 
story and uh, through Chinese famous phrases. I remember there was one time I talked about the story of Jing Cheng Suo Zhi, Jing Shi Wei Kai. There was a one general when uh, went to have a fight, and uh, his uh, his army was uh, surrounded by the enemy, and he was the only one went out, and uh, and he the 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 enemy was chasing him behind, and he was. Uh, uh, riding his horse and run, 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 run. And just at this time in front of him, there was a tiger coming out. He was so focused. And in front of the tiger, he had no choice but to kill the tiger. So he took out his arrow and bow. Pew! The tiger stopped. And he kept on. A few days later, he reached to his uh, his base and got new uh, new army, new resources, and then came back and fight and fought again. He win the the, the 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 fight, and he came back to the same place because he was worried about the tiger. He went back, he did not see a tiger, but in the exact place he saw a piece of granite rock. He was so surprised he could not understand. He went to an immortal. What was going on? I was killing a a tiger. But now the tiger was not there. What was going on? The immortal and the sage told him, It was not a tiger. When you were running away, when you were trying to run away, you were so focused, you do not see, you did not see anything. It was a piece of rock. It was a piece of rock in the middle of the road and you have to you have to run and you mistook it as a tiger and you took out your arrow, bow and arrow and shoot on that tiger. It's actually your effort of fighting your fear. So your you shoot, you have so much force and effort, you shoot through the rock. Jing cheng suo zhi, jing shi wei kai. When you make effort, you make so much effort. With your heart and soul, even the huge rock can piercing through. Anything will give way to a determined heart. That's the story of Jing Cheng Suo Zhi, Jing Shi Wei Kai. Et cette histoire, je vais parler en français, en chinois, en anglais. 所以这个故事的名字就叫 Jing Cheng Suo Zhi, Jing Shi Wei Kai. 你的心到了, 你的力气, 花了，这个世界所有的困难都会在你的面前推倒。Okay, okay, so that is the idea of this, and uh, and it's dinner time. <laughs> I am going to have my dinner dinner with my team. You have a beautiful, beautiful evening. I love you. I really do. Do, 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 do. Do, do, do. Get ready for my story series. Bye-bye.